Is it upstairs too? Is it upstairs? Alright. Guys, be careful here. Alright, everybody quiet. Alright, ladies. There's no ladies here, is there? No. Hello, gentlemen. Welcome to ne Necrotech. This is our new scientific experimental laboratory and dig. We have discovered many wonderful things here. But before we start, we have an uh, introductory video that will show you exactly what we're here for. So when we go inside, a seat and we'll start the video right away. Uh, you hold on to it. The video is three minutes, but we don't have another tour yet. Hello, and welcome to Necrotech Research Dig. I'm Dr. Muhaha. Here at Necrotech, our mission is to establish the future by unearthing the past. At the center of our research is the Lazarus Particle, discovered by the late Dr. Davros. Lazarus particles act upon dead tissue, reanimating it and restoring it to a lifelike state. It even works on the deceased brain restoring a semblance of neural activity, sometimes even to a point capable of speech. Imagine what can be learned by using the Lazarus particles on some of history's greatest figures. After Dr. Davros' untimely death in a lab accident, Necrotech was established to continue his research. The next development came with the recent discovery of this undocumented, unexplored crypt. Through a special arrangement with the United States government, Necrotech was allowed to handle all archaeological exploration and documentation of the crypt in exchange for the ability to continue our research in this unspoiled environment. So, enjoy your tour as you witness our efforts to blaze a path to humanity's future through the bodies of the dead. Oh, good. Oh, my God. <laughs> we got some 
This is Edgar Allan Poe. We thought he was buried up on the hill, but it turned out that he was secretly moved down here due to the fear of grave robbery. So we discovered this brand new crypt, and we're very excited about it. Edgar Allan Poe was born in 1809. He died in 1849. He was a writer, a, uh, a poet, uh, an, an editor, and a, uh, and, uh, uh, and, and a critic. He was a part of the uh, romance uh, novel movement. He also uh, started the first detective novels, which eventually led to science fiction. He worked his whole life in writing. He didn't make any money, and he died a very poor person. But we knew some of his writings, right? We have The Raven, The Pit and the Pendulum, The Raven, The Cost of the Montiago, The Telltale. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, all right. Um, Please get out of here. Everybody. Yeah, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Wait. I'm leaving. Come on. Come on. Go, 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 Come on. Go, ah, don't shoot! All right, all right, all right. Guns down, guns down. They're human. Come on, guys, get in here, guys. Come on. There is something move, 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 move. Back. I'm out, I'm out. All right. Come on, guys. 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 We've been here investigating Necrotech. The boys in Washington were right to be suspicious of them. So far, what we found, it isn't good. Uh-oh. Someone's got the phone. Hit the emergency power. So, what we believe is that most of the main power has been out. We've got our threat lights on and some of the floodgates up. However, the main power is offline. So, you need to get to the, the main vault doors. They will open after you do two things. One, reestablish power throughout the facility. And two, get a pass key. I had one on me, but I lost it in the midst of combat. So, if you can find a command staff or any other personnel, they should have it on them. Now, if we work together, we can get out of here. Go, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, people. Um, oh crap. Did you switch the power on? Try it again. Wait, it worked. Slowly, I think we can sneak past them. They're dancing. Slowly. Don't draw their attention. Alright, you guys got the pass card? 
Okay. He already took it, Joey. Oh my God, come here, I need help. Come here. No, hold it. I don't want to open it. You.